Okay, hello everyone. This is Casey from WebBuddy. Now, today in this short tutorial video, I want to share with you how you can enable uh, to see the entries that people submit using your WP form if you are using the free version. So, let me share with you by default if your website is using WP forms and when you click on the entries, you won't be able to see the records that who have used the form to send it to you because this entries feature for WP form it is a pro version you need to pay WP form in order to see these entries so I'm going to share with you um, what plugin you can use to view the entries without paying okay so the plugin that we are going to install, you need to go to plugins, add new plugin. And once you're on this page, you can type in email log. So just search for the keyword email log. Then when you scroll down, this is the one that I'm currently using. It's called email log. Okay, and you can just install. You can see that I've already installed this plugin. So for you, you can just click install now and then click activate. There are also other plugins, for example, this one WP mail logging. By the time of recording, this plugin version is not tested for my version of WordPress, which I'm using the latest WordPress version. So I choose this plugin instead. So after you have installed this plugin, you can go to the function over here, email log and click view logs. Then you will be able to see all the uh, form submission that people use your WP form to submit. And you can click here, view content to view all the content. You can view the raw email content or you can preview content as HTML. So for example, let us use the form. So I go to contact us and I type in just for testing purpose. Test at gmail.com this is a test email form submission then i click submit okay so it has been submitted and now i'm going to my a dashboard email log click on view logs you can see that this is the new entry so when i click view content uh, raw email content you can see you can see the name this is the name that just now I type in the email. This is the command or message uh, from here. Okay. So just to share with you the advantage of using such an email log is number one is that you can also see other emails that are being sent out from your website. For example, I have a security plugin WordFence. So WordFence will send out emails to me to inform me whenever there are some security issue related to the plugin or the website so it will also lock down those uh, emails if you have woocommerce or an e-commerce store in your wordpress website this plugin will also record and lock down all the emails transactional emails that are sent out from the website so this is a very uh, good plugin that you can install for free so i hope that you find this recommendation useful uh, if so uh, please like this video and subscribe to my channel for my future uh, tutorial if you have any questions feel free to post in the comment section below i'll see you in the next video thank you